to another Woolly Review and today we have Sardar Hayfield double knitting with wool which was actually in a happy mail to me but I have found it on the cheapest place I found it is called Shirley Walls Limited for £1.99 a skein now there's a hundred grams in this this originally was bought for three pounds 40 which is just a little bit under what i've seen on other sites so it's about the average this is in shade 0091 but i'm not reviewing the shade which i really like but i'm actually reviewing the wool itself now it's 300 meters approximately 328 yards 80 percent acrylic 20 percent wool because it says with wool um, recommended hook size 4 well I'm using my 6 my special custom made hook specially for me specially for me link down below Jelena's Etsy store I'm going to be using a 6 um, but they recommend a 4 machine washable on a wool cycle washed up colours separately well, I would hope so too. Now, can I find an end? Yes, I can. I found one. So I'm going to put this on my funky little holder, which I absolutely adore. Almost as much as my custom hook. Now, this isn't a tutorial. This is a review. So whatever comes up in the swatch, if I make a mistake, I make a mistake. What'll ever will be, will be six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Flipping heck is this squeaking? Okay, so that feels, feels like a whole ball of wool. It's all squidgy and stuff. Um, it's not overly soft, but it's certainly not bad feeling let me shove it on my face hang on it's a little bit rough i wouldn't want it close to my skin because it is a little bit rough but anyway so let's go in with working with it and see how it works up I am worried about this being splitty because it looks like it's going to split on me. I don't know if that's just my imagination. I don't know. But it looks kind of splitty. Of course, I'll let you know if it does because it's all part of a review, right? Now, actually, that little that little bit, it, it feels really, really light really light I haven't used this before um, this is my first and I personally have no problem with wool in fact I prefer it it's not overly scratchy and it feels fine within my hands Again, very light feeling. Airy almost. Not eerie, airy. No, it feels it feels fine at the moment. So I'll do one more row after this. to complicate things a little bit because why not? That's what I do, complicate things. 
but no i'm i'm very very surprised how light it feels i don't know how weird that sounds but using it i'm fine i'm very very pleased it isn't splitting very pleased I am dreading frogging it because of its little fluffs. But we'll, we'll come to that bridge in a moment, in a matter of a couple of stitches time not stitches in time we do those without hooking but making this wonderful curve messing up the stitches as I go because we all mess up stitches every now and again and that's why we frog which is about to happen but yeah, I'm, I'm very surprised at how light it feels. Very surprised. Um, it feels okay in my hands, in my fingers. Let's do the last couple stitches. I'm just gonna make them standard half doubles because I'm too lazy to do any more. Okay. So, what does it feel like? Back of the hand, fine. Light, fine. There's no stretch to it, there's no elasticity. Under my jawline, that feels a little bit rough. Not bad, bad rough, just a little bit rough. But you know, I messed up a stitch, so let's frog. Fast frogging seems fine. Slow frogging seems fine. Not a problem. There's a lot of kink, a lot of kink. And it's very, very, very strong. That's really, really good. That's a good sign. So let's wrap her up. And then we will, oh, I just created a knot. Oops. That wasn't meant to happen. Oops. Okay, let's bring them in. So, Would I turn my back on it? Um, no, definitely not. Would I go, if that's all there is, then fine, okay. <gasps> no. Would I be quite happy to use that? And yeah, that's fine, not a problem. Yes, I'm going to leave it at that. I'm going to leave it at the three ladybirds. That's what I'm going to do. So Sadar Hayfield, double knitting with wool. Cheapest place I found it. Shirley Wool's uh, Limited is down below. As is Jelena's Etsy store that makes the personalised hooks with brilliant detailing. Um, but this is my review on this wool, not the colour, but the wool itself. That's it. If it was any use to you whatsoever, please, please give a thumbs up. It really helps us guys out. And of course, if you fancy it, maybe subscribe down below too. Until next time, thank you. Bye-bye.